y'all it's your girl Aaliyah beauty back with another video and if you're new here, obviously you can tell my name is Aaliyah and if you're not welcome back my beautiful subscribers so as y'all can see I'm back y'all my camera is still broken I'm using my mom's iPad at the moment so like let me show you the proof that it's broken like you see the lens right you see how it look when I turn it on you see that how it moves and then you see that it has that little notification to tell me turn it off and turn it back on and try again or whatever and yeah i'm gonna just just record be a little, 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 little oh my gosh i'm gonna just record from my mom ipad like this is what i used to do before I use her phone and her ipad because my phone don't have enough storage so i need to get a new phone and all of that but when i do get a new phone i'm gonna just record from my phone but i'm gonna just record now from her ipad until that get fixed because she not trying to fix it so i'm gonna just have to try to fix it myself or whatever so yeah in today's video i'm gonna be doing a um high school freshman advice and sophomore advice so i hope you guys enjoy the video so yeah the first advice i will give you this is for the freshmen i think i'm gonna go back and forth freshman to sophomore freshman to sophomore but i'm gonna tell y'all so the first advice this is for the freshmen let me tell y'all the first advice, first day, okay, I'm going to give you a first advice for the first day of school. First day of school, don't come with mad supplies and stuff in your book bag or whatever because then you're going to look like a fool with mad stuff. Like, especially if you come with a handbag. If you're a girl, you come with a handbag, your shoulder's going to be hurting you. And then if you end up wearing a book bag, both shoulders are going to be hurting you. So, like, if you come with a binder, mad books, mad markers, mad this and mad that, you're going to look dumb because you don't need... All of those supplies you're gonna need like a pencil pen maybe a highlighter and like two notebooks and two folders because you don't want to carry all those stuff and then yeah because you they're gonna tell you to write down stuff they're gonna tell you like they're gonna tell you to write down little like notes and stuff and then like um supplies and stuff some people might tell you to, to write the supply list down for some classes and some may just have it printed already for you so don't carry so much stuff because then i don't want y'all looking dumb now come on now i don't want my supporters looking dumb going to school with mad stuff now like yeah next advice i'm gonna give you as a freshman is to like at least become friends with a couple of upperclassmen because like you want to get to like know people you don't want to just have just freshman friends so if you have like soft or sophomore friend that would be good because you know they just came out of being a freshman so they could tell you like everything like you know how it is and all of that and plus you want to have a, a sophomore friend or a junior friend or whatever most likely not a senior because they be acting like they too boochie to talk to freshmen like you was a freshman three years ago don't even do that anyways um, you could be friends with the upperclassmen because, like, say if you don't know what class to go to, the freshmen can't help you because they know to, they new to the school. So you have to ask at least a sophomore, or a junior for help. You feel me? So, yeah, that's pretty much it for that topic. Next one for the freshmen. I know y'all see my story time. Me as a freshman dating that senior. If you a freshman, please. god please please be with me listen to me do not date a senior i repeat do not date a senior because all they want to do is just smash they try and get their little good luck points whatever these boys do these whatever they do and if you were freshman please do not date <laughs> i don't regret seeing this but please do not date a football player because you know don't date any boys in the athlete stuff until you reach like a higher grade because they're gonna try to play you too especially these little boys they're gonna try to play you i'm telling you please don't if you want to do it go ahead you live and you learn but i'm just warning y'all now these seniors ain't shit okay 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 <laughs> and okay what's next for the freshmen 
the specs, the specs, the specs. Um, if you come to school as a freshman, you don't gotta dress up and all of that for the first day of school, but make sure you still look cute because if you do still look cute, the upperclassmen or anybody, they will like compliment you like, girl, you look cute. I like your hair, whatever. Yeah, please come with your hair done. Because even if you do come with your natural hair, like, you don't do it like a, a bun. Do something to it. Look cute. I'm not saying that everybody, you know, gotta look drippy with the Gucci, the Yeezys and all that. But, you know, you can wear a little fashion over your little sheen, you know? Your little sheen. They, anybody, everybody shopping at sheen now. They don't gotta know a sheen. Because, baby, I got a sheen home for y'all too. Coming soon. She, they, they, they wouldn't know. You got your shirt for three dollars. They, don't, they wouldn't know. Don't mind the background. My little brother and my stuff is still here, but yeah, they playing. But yeah, come looking cute or whatever. You feel me? You could come a little two piece suit like this with your little nice shoes on or whatever. Some G phase on with this. Yep, y'all get what I'm saying. Y'all get what I'm saying. You don't know, come with your little chain, your little earrings. You got your edges on soup soup. You know? Yeah, y'all get what I'm saying. Next one is don't no, this is for the sophomores. This is for the sophomores. When you reach sophomore, like when you go to the next grade, all them friends you had in freshman year, all them ten friends you had, is gonna go down to five. Then later in the middle of the year, probably go down to two. So I'm just letting y'all know. All them friends you had freshman year. It's not all gonna be your friends when you become a sophomore. They change. They think, oh, cause I'm going to a different grade. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. No, sweetie. They not your friends. They, oh yeah, we friends forever. No, no. You get new friends every year. I'm telling y'all this, cause this is what happened to me. This is what happened to me, literally. I got new friends this year. People I didn't talk to freshman year, I'm friends with them now. I got closer to them now. I'm just letting y'all know, like, literally. Like, one of my friends, she, I'm about to be a junior, she about to be a senior. You see how I got friends that's higher than me? When I was in freshman year, she was, like, in her sophomore year. You see how I got friends that's, like, in a higher grade that could tell me, like, everything, like, what's going on and all of that? Not the drama that's going on, like, you know, everything that goes on with the school and how it goes and all of that. And for freshman year, please come to your classes early. Don't think, oh, you in high school, get a, a, a. you could come to school late. No, just not middle school. No, don't be, no, that's not what we're not going to do. That's, that's what we're not going to do. Especially if you, to my supporter, this is what we're not going to do. We're not coming to school late. You got to get perfect attendance, baby. You got to get your, your honor roll. That's my honor roll up there. Yes, I'm showing off. Yes, I don't care. I don't care. It's not a hundred, but it is a, hold on. Let me tell you what it is. It's a, a 92.23. I'm still doing good. I don't care. It, it's not 100, though, but I'm still on honor roll, right? Thank you. If you even can't do honor roll, at least you could get perfect attendance. I'm not saying everybody's smart and everybody this and every that. But at least pass your classes, please. Go to classes on time. And this is another one for the freshmen. Please don't skip. Oh, you friends with this sophomore. Your sophomore friends had to skip your junior friend. No. They... They're not going to do good. you just not coming to this school. You have a chance to do good. They they done messed up already. <laughs> That's their problem. Don't be like them. You feel me? Do not be like them. Because let me tell you, our freshman year, I was skipping. Hopefully my mom and my sister don't watch this video. But that's whatever. It's the past. But guess what? Listen, though. I was skipping. But guess what? Still got that on a roll, right? <laughs> Still did my schoolwork, right? <laughs> but guess what, y'all? I'd never skip. I stopped skipping sophomore year though, so it's whatever. And I definitely don't skip junior year. Well, junior year is just not starting. And senior year, that's deaf. Deaf don't skip that year either. Even though I'm not a senior, but I don't skip that year either because that's important. Junior and senior, that's important. You feel me? You feel me? You feel me? But yeah. And for what else with sophomores? Oh, yeah. Hold on. I gotta think, yeah. I gotta think. I think, cause <laughs> hold on, so this is for the freshmen. Let me tell y'all. If you're coming to school, right, you got you a little boo thing or whatever. They they talk to. This is another thing too. Don't talk to the 
to the sophomores and the juniors. That's good. The seniors, I already told y'all, out the window, you see? Out that window. By the way, my curtain thing felt broke, y'all, so, yes, I'm sorry for the ghetto-ness back there, but, yeah. Let me tell y'all, do not fight over no boy when you're a freshman. What is wrong with you? Especially if y'all just dating for, like, two weeks or for a month, you're bugged. I'm, if y'all was dating now, yeah, y'all dating all the way from freshman to sophomore, yeah, yeah, fight for your man. But if y'all just, like, a week or two weeks and you're just talking... And you see him with somebody else, talking to somebody else, kissing on Why are you fighting over him, sis? This is what this this is what we not finna do. That's ghetto. That's ratchet. Like, stop. Stop the track right there. You're bugging. Two weeks, one week, a month. Yeah. That's what we not finna do. That's really what we not finna do. This is another one too for the freshmen. Hold on. I'm not trying to come for y'all if you if you about to be a freshman, but like I'm really trying to help y'all, like for real. But like, if you a freshman and it's your first day coming to school, don't be loud and ghetto in the hallway, especially with the person that you literally just met. Like you don't even really know them at that. You don't know if they a snake. Like hello, and plus it's your first day, so you know the seniors and everybody's gonna come for you. Like bro, who was that? Like. Why is she not loud in the hallway? Like, type stuff like that. Because I would do that too. Like, yo, bro. Get this kid, bro. Like, why is she so loud? Or why he's so loud? Like that too. And this is for advice for the freshman boys. Because I don't just want to say things for girls. Even though I know it's probably mostly girls that watch my video. Because, like, you feel me? You feel me? Except for, like, my boyfriend. I know he watched my video. And my brothers. I know they watch my video. But, like, for the boys... If you're a freshman and then you see them all like some, you see they put posters up like, oh, sign up for football, sign up for basketball, sign up for, what's another sport? Soccer, even though I don't like that. But like, if they say sign up for that, bro, sign up, bro. Sign up. Because you don't want to be in school and track too. I almost forgot track. You don't want to be in school. Like, come on, become an athlete. And if you're a girl too, and they say sign up for chair, sign up for volleyball, track. Girl, do it. You need to. Let's go. We gotta get. We gotta get our muscles. We gotta. We gotta get our muscles. You feel me? <laughs> but you know, you got especially cheerleading. Like I know mad girls wanna do cheerleading, bro. It's fun. You, it's fun. Even though you, even though, the, if you come to my school, even though you gotta do a lot. Like my school, my cheer team, they have us do a lot. Like if somebody get in trouble, we all get in trouble together. Like. Yes, we gotta go to these bum games. The only game I only really wanna go to is like football and lacrosse, cause you know my brother and my man, they 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 play that they play their sports, like you know, you know I be out there like go team <laughs> Yo, I'm so ghetto. I'm so ghetto. But yeah, I think that's that's pretty much it. I don't really have no more advice for y'all, like honestly. But just be careful for the freshmen. Be careful for your for your first week. I'm going to say first week. And for sophomores, y'all already know what goes on. Y'all already know. People is not your friends. <laughs> Drama is not it. <laughs> and just know, people change up on you. Like, they really just change up on you. People out here is snake. Snake. And let me tell you another thing. People will just smile up in your face. And next thing you know, they're chatting about you. And the next thing you know, you you hear it come right back to you. Yo, bro, she was just da 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 da. Yeah, you see, people is not your friends, y'all. I'm just letting y'all know that. I'm just letting y'all know that. And people, like people that do, be picking their boyfriends or their boyfriends, like boy that's friends, over their close girlfriend. Like, who really does that? Like. I wanna fight. I don't do that, y'all. I'm equal. But if I have to, I will pin my man. If I have to, I will. <laughs> Cause if I want to, I will. Okay? But I don't do that. But if I will, I will if I have to. And why my camera keeps mother friggin' sliding? Like, did I tell you to move? Anyways, if I have to, I will switch up on somebody and pick my man real quick. But yeah, I'm coming off a topic, and my camera keep motherfucking slaughtering. But yeah. Okay, okay, I'm just gonna leave you like this then. Just like this. 
Is it moving? Okay. But y'all, yeah, that's it for this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And stay tuned because I might do another video right after this. Because y'all know I've been missing for like a week, I guess you could say. But yeah, that's it for this video. And my camera keep, you know what? Let's stop. Yeah, like I was saying, after I just didn't stop that. But like I was saying, y'all, that's it for this video. Make sure you guys stay tuned because I will be doing another video right after this. Because, you know, like I said in the earlier clip, I've been missing for like a week, I guess you could say, I think. Let me check. Let me go check how long I've been missing. Nah. Cause I know y'all been missing me, me. Nah, let me stop. Uh, it's been. Cause I'm not gonna count that video. Yeah, it's been it's been six days. Even though I did posted this thing, but that don't really count. I was just updating y'all that my camera broke, so I posted that two days ago. But the like actual video video that I actually post, that's it's been six days. So. I'm coming back to y'all. Period. It's a week. Yeah, it's a week and one day. A week and one day. So. No, yeah. No, no. I'm bugging. I like a week and one day. I sound so dumb. It's been six days. We're just going to leave it at that. But I'm going to do a video right after this, y'all. So I love you guys. And peace.